happened in gate 13. But Kelp Forest has moved in. Flag goes up. Gates go back. They're off and racing from that 1200 meter mark. Katsu, as well as Carlatino and Gimmy's Laddie, were a little bit slow into stride. We'll have to take their medicine from the back end of the field. First one to respond, Wiley Riley, Black Egret, also Rainbow Colors, Caitlin's Boy. They made a line of four across the final 900 meters, a deep route on the track. We've got Black Egret, followed by Ozan Kerr. Then comes Master Point racing just two lengths ahead of Gimme's Lad, who's got about eight lengths to make up. As they crack on the pace house in front, it's still the same four with Wiley Riley, who is the leader. Deep routes on the track, we've got Rainbow Colors. Then comes Caitlin's Boy, followed by Black Egret, further back to Master Point. Oz and Kerr, Jimmy's laddie still has about four lengths to make up. Katsu's net's best, Kelp Forest is towards the inside as they go into the final 400 meters. Racing towards the outside, we've got Black Edred and Oz and Kerr as they pick up the running. Jimmy's laddie's now starting to make headway, move into the race. As they enter the final 350 meters, it's Oz and Kerr who has the lead with Jimmy's laddie. Then comes Black Edred, deep route master point is trying to run on rainbow colors towards the inside. As they enter the final furlong, it's Jimmy's laddie who's picked up on the inside in the black and yellow salts. Jimmy's laddie with his length advantage. Then comes Oz and Kerr and further back to Black Edred, but it's James Sesson match as Jimmy's laddie wins going away. Seconds from the go to Oz and Kerr, then came Black Edred followed by Master Point, Road Mail, and then came Rainbow Colors.